backfilling behind a retaining wall, is there anything specific you need to do? Right, one consideration is how much water is gonna be coming off the bank. Mm -hmm. uh, so if there's gonna be a lot of water coming down, we need to take that water out away from the base of the wall. Uh, and we're gonna use a three inch perforated drain pipe. Okay. Plastic drain pipe, you get that at any uh, home improvement store. That needs to lay along the top of uh, your um, uh, footing. And then there's also a filter cloth. We don't want dirt leaching through sure. the front of your wall. And you also don't want dirt leaching from and in, in coming into your drain rock and, and clogging that all up. Okay. All right? So this is a filter cloth and then it will go down alongside the wall. The drain pipe will fit on top of it and then it'll come up along the, uh, the dirt bank and then the drain rock will fit inside. Do you have to do this for every wall? The, you know, the drain pipe, no. Again, okay. it all depends on how moisture, but we do recommend three-quarter inch drain rock along the back. Okay, great. Well, let's put it in. You bet. Mm -hmm.